thanks for joining me again on Funny Tried. I hope you're having a wonderful day. In today's lesson, we're going to study five words you are probably not pronouncing correctly. So get your paper and pen ready and let's dive right in. The first word I have on my list today, we commonly pronounce it as believe. I think I've treated it in this class before, but let us just look at it again because I see come across a lot of people that say believe, believe in me, oh God. All right, let's see here. The word is spelled B-E-L-I-E-V-E. -E. This is where you have... Uh, me to watch out for the B here changes to it's not silent it changes to short vowel A if you look at the transcription here we have A A that's the middle high vowel A so <coughs> excuse me to get the pronunciation for this word correctly just add the B to A and that gives you B so you have believe and not believe. So maybe some even say believe. That is, uh, they change this V to F as an F. But that's not the pronunciation, the correct pronunciation. So what you have, if we follow the transcription, we have B, A, E, E, and V. And that gives us belief. Please believe in me. <laughs> All right, let's go to number two. Oh, this word, some Nigerian fans, I like the penance word, I like uh, the one to sound American, why, 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 <laughs> I'm sorry, this word, well, for American pronunciation, American don't say water, but I don't want to treat that in this class today, if you want to learn why the pronunciation is different from the British pronunciation, Come on, just sign up for the extended diction coaching and we can have a thorough class together that you would love. Mm. All right, so let's get back to what we're learning. Here we have um, W-A-C-E-R and here we say water. So water, but that's not the correct pronunciation. Here you have um, a, 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 min, oh, sorry, a consonant and you have a long form. Oh, a long oh. So when you add what to oh, it gives you what. Then you have the consonant. Then you have the sure sound, the middle high vowel e. Eh. So all you need to do, you go from what oh, to e eh, to uh, sorry, what oh, to and e, eh, and that gives you water, water. Please let's drop. And it's really mothers. Um. You need to know what um, pronunciation you're applying when you're speaking with your children. Water, uh, water. Some people say water, water. I don't know. It's water. Let's, if you're using the American pronunciation, fine. But your children cannot be going to school where they're using British curriculum and you are speaking something else at home. So you need to be careful when you're speaking with the children. So this word. The, uh, the British pronunciation is water, water. All right, now let's go to number three words that we ha I have on my list today is A W F U L. Even I am guilty of this. I say awful. Don't you say awful? Okay, I think a lot of us say awful. Well, for this word, you have um, if we follow the transcription, we have all. Yeah, we have, and then we have the middle I vowel. A, a short sound that we have uh, oh sorry oh yes that's the correct one and we have L. so is that you pronounce in this word all fail I think this is a weak form or oh, you saying or oh, you saying all oh. here we have all oh, oh, a consonant cluster flip you can call that consonant blend flip 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 so all fail not it's not awful with U so when you're pronouncing this word, remember that there's no ooh there. Stop saying awful. Awful. That's awful. We know what awful is when something's bad and so on. Alright. 
so we either we say alpha or alpha okay so not awful shadow there's no ooh okay sorry <laughs> forgive my nigerian chai sha i just said sha <laughs> okay let's go to number four now this word we say blood blood we pronounce with all the sh oh, small all here we say all so this word is pronounced with uh. So when you're pronouncing this word, <coughs> excuse me, B L A L D. Remember that the double L changes to or take the position of the short, short uh, money of tongue. Uh, uh, uh. You raise it the back of your tongue near the roof of your mouth. Uh. You move it back or uh, release it to produce a sound. Uh, uh. So instead of oh. Uh, yeah, uh, so blood, blood. Let's follow the transcription, please. So here you have blood, uh, and the, and that gives you blood, blood, uh, 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 blood, uh, not all, but uh, blood, mm? blood, no, blood, yes. Okay, let's go to number five. Number five, oh, the word I have. Oh, my number five list is pronounced here as education. Oh, sorry, <laughs> education. I've taught this. I think this would be like the third or fourth time I'm teaching it in this class. The word is not education, my people. The word is education. Education. Okay. So let's. I I would love for us to sound more educated. If you I've been to school and you are educated. I mean, with the Bali and I mean your certificate, then you should sound educated. Please, so shining this aspect of your life, of your polish rather. So let's go again. Here, <coughs> excuse me. Here we have uh, the letter E changes to A and the D. The people are refusing, most Nigerians are refusing to drop. Is j. Look at it here. J. Normally, this is how we write this. This is the consonant sound. You have j. So, you always remember that after the e is j. Is the consonant sound j. Okay, so you have e j. Then, after that, you have the u. E j. The word next is a. a, 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 a there's consonant k and you have a diphthong a, a, a. The yash and a and n and it gives you education. Education and not education. So let's run it down. We have believe. B a l e v believe. W r a water. Of a l off or off off okay sorry off and not off blood uh, and gives you blood and not blood edge ook edge and mm, education <laughs> and that is all I have for you today my people I hope this has been helpful Please keep practicing after, even after this class. And for extended diction coaching, reach out to me at www.drsadicaconsulting.com. 